Every year, millions of kids are enrolled in programs that parents hope will build the foundation for school success. That pre-K time is really important and uh, more emphasis needs to be put on that. I wanted him to, you know, be learning his ABCs and things, but also in a fun way. But does the cost of early education pay off over a lifetime? So what we do in this program, what we do is different, is follow long-term outcomes. Researchers analyze decades of information from two government-funded early childhood programs that serve disadvantaged kids from birth to age five. One of these programs, ABC Care, offered cognitive, social, emotional, and physical development. For every dollar spent on this program, there was a return of more than six dollars. What we're getting is the structure of, uh, of returns when we include the health returns are as high as 14 percent per annum, a huge benefit cost ratio. Children who participated in the programs had higher test scores and less grade retention. At age 35, their health was better. Men had lower blood pressure and lower drug use women had better adult employment. Researchers say high quality programs focus on the whole child, not just academic learning. Parents can look for programs where there is a focus on health. For example, having nurses on staff and developmental screenings. Also, check to see children are provided with meals and snacks to ensure access to good nutrition. Early childhood options that may pay off years down the road. I'm Jessica Sanchez reporting.